wondering, hmm, I would like to go visit wine country, but you know, I just don't have the time or the money or the resources. Well, guess what? Wine country is coming right here to Arizona. As a matter of fact, it's coming to Scottsdale. I'm gonna give you all the details along with this guy right here. I want you to meet Joel Peterson. He's the executive director of Paso Robles Wine Country Alliance. He's here with all the details of the event where they're bringing the wine country to Scottsdale. Joel, I am so jealous of the job that you have. It's a tough one. Yeah, I know, right? Someone's got to do it, but no, I'm super <laughs> excited. We've got over 200 wineries here in Paso Robles and uh, I get to work with almost all the wineries here and the growers and we put out this great this great product called called Pass Rebels Wine and we're looking forward to coming to Arizona. I am so excited. Okay, we're going to get all the details with a special offer coming up in just a moment, but you know, we've all heard of Napa and you know other places in in California that we can go Paso Robles, you know, I haven't heard a lot about it. So tell me about it. Where's it at? Describe it to me. Yeah, great question. So Paso Robles is right in the heart of California's central coast. So we're halfway between Los Angeles and San Francisco. We're north of Santa Barbara and south of Monterey. We're only 25 miles from the coast. It's uh, something some people call it California's undiscovered coast. Yeah. Um, it's just great. I mean, it's, you know, our entire county has less than 250,000 people. It's a pretty small town. Our town only has about 30,000 people. Um, there's direct flights daily from actually San Luis Obispo, which is our local airport, to Phoenix. So it's getting more and more discovered, certainly over the last couple of years, as people try to escape uh, big cities. Um, oh. It's a really magical place, and uh, we make some great wines here. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to go check it out. But I'm so glad that you're bringing it all here to us here in Scottsdale, which is going to be so awesome. Now, you're planning this event. It's going to be October 27th at the uh, the, uh, the McCormick in Scottsdale. What is going to happen at this event? What are we going to learn? Yeah, we're super excited. So we're bringing 21 wineries from Pastor Bulls with us along with some other folks who make spirits, lavender, honey, some local kind of crafts and artisans from Paso Robles. People are going to walk in, they're going to see a bunch of different winemakers, different bunch of different wines. They can meet the winemakers and kind of get a taste of what, what Paso Robles wine country is like. Um, we'll actually have some hoteliers coming with us as, as well. So it's going to be kind of this full immersion of what it's like to come to wine country without getting on the plane, going through security and flying here uh, to give you a taste so that maybe you want to come visit us in the future. Ah, I see. I see. You're, you're going to tease us is what you're going to do is because we're all going to book our tickets out there as soon as possible. So tell me. Um, so, you know, one thing I've learned about wineries and meeting uh, winemakers is that, that everybody's got a story. And sometimes the wine just tastes different when you hear their story. Is that true? It's, it's so true, actually. Yeah. Whether you're at the winery, at the tasting room, meeting people or you're, you're pouring across the table from them, you can meet the winemaker, hear why they grew that wine, um, you know, why they named it that way, how it's made. Um, why it tastes that way it just, it just it gives you a connection to that wine and wine such a kind of a spiritual drink anyway in terms of like you know connecting people so it's really fun to have the winemakers in the room telling those stories and then the thing is there's, there's going to be a big diversity of them there's over 21 wineries coming which means we'll have over 100 150 wines to choose some choose from and you can walk around the tables meet different people try some white wines try some red wines you know whatever you want oh my gosh all right i'm in i'm in you're also offering up a master class what is that about yeah, so for the trade, for the, anyone in the wine trade, there's a master class uh, that's from one to two thirty that day at the McCormick, and that's for anyone who you know is is in the wine trade. If they if they're a sommelier, they buy wine, they're a server, uh, they can come. Um, and if you go to PasoWine.com, make a reservation, and it's a deep dive. It's an hour and a half of going through five different wines, the soils, the climates here, which really kind of explain what what makes our region unique. Ooh, I love that. I love that. Okay, and so you're bringing along some other partners because you. I, I, and I'm going to use this as a pun, so don't laugh too hard, because you're, we're going to give it a taste of the wine country, Paso Robles wine country, with all the partners that you're bringing along. Exactly. I think that's what we call the tasting tour. So we partnered <laughs> with our our, our, our our friends over at Travel Paso, and they're the ones who are bringing the spirits, uh, some honey, some lavender, I think a couple of hoteliers. So they're, they're kind of the partners we we, we have that round out our our ecosystem of tourism, really. So not only will you have the wine folks, you'll have some other things that really make that a fun event. Um, if, you're, if you're not so much into wine, you can get the other things that we do here in wine country. Oh my gosh. All right. Sign me up. Sign me up. All right. I want to give our viewers all the information. The event is Thursday, October 27th from 6 until 8.30 p.m. at the McCormick Scottsdale. It's at 7421 North Scottsdale Road. Here's that special offer. Use promo code SLL22 and get $5 off your ticket. For more information, go to PasoWine.com.